Hey everyone, hope all of you are doing great and welcome back to yet another video. In this video, we're going to explore one of the best projects which I have found in the entire code pan. I, and I couldn't stop myself making a video on this because this is such an amazing art this person, Julian, has created with codes. So that's all we're going to explore in this and I'm really fascinating about the project which he has built. All the project which he has built and uploaded in code pan is absolutely phenomenal. But this is the one is my favorite. So I couldn't stop myself making a video on it. So let me tell you everything that how it has built and what are the functionality and how he has built this entire thing, okay? Let me give you a quick overview that how it works. So as you can see, this is the universe which he created. So we have all these nine planets. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, oh sorry, eight planets, there is no Pluto. So if you want to look at the sun, so this is the sun, you will get the information about the sun that how kilometer, name kilometer orbit and velocity if you click on mercury you can see right now you it will highlight the mercury and the distance from the sun it's moving around the suns if you click on venus now it will switch to venus and will tell you the speed kilometer per hour if you click on earth our planet and how far what is the speed of the planet and moving around the sun in the same way if we go to the mars here it is it's moving around the sun. If you click on Jupiter, here we have on the Jupiter, it's highlighting. If you click on Saturn, you can see the orbit is also getting highlighted, Saturn. If we click on Uranus, there it is, very slow, far from the sun. If we click on Neptune, it's too far, it feel like it's not moving at all, but it's really fast, okay? So this is how it will look on a 2D, okay? 2d but if you want to have a look as a 3d he also added that functionality so here you will find a couple of buttons so if you click on the wrist button it will become a 3d as you can see you can able to see that from the top and you can highlight everything as it is as it is click it will switch and you can easily able to see everything this is from 3d and this one is 2d and here is also providing some options so if you click on this it will highlight like this so all the planets will come in one row and you can click and you can check the details as you can see if you click on uranus this is the details jupiter mars earth venus mercury and the sun let's bring to the 3d because i really loved it and let's bring to normal one and there is another couple of tabs he has so this one is for the speed which is already highlighting if you click on size so as you can see oh my god this one is really incredible you can see how beautifully the sun size got bigger and we can able to see the other planets moving around the sun look at our our earth there it is it's going very fast and beautiful it's looking if you click on the distance let's see what will happen okay it will show the distance from earth so you can see you can click here and you can see the planets are moving around the suns so this will highlight and increase the side of the sun and it's absolutely incredible like it's amazing so this is how it will look and this project is absolutely incredible and it's 100 percent responsive for all the devices so so let me show you the responsiveness so if i click here as you can see it's 100 percent responsive for the mobile phone as well so this is how it will look on a mobile phone if you click on the data here you can able to find the list of the planet name so you can click on and it will switch to that uranus saturn jupiter mars earth venus mercury sun and if you click on the controls here you will get the controls like if you want to have a look from a 2d platform you can do that 3d this is how it will look if you click on speed you will get the details of the every planets uh, moving around the speeds and this is how the sun size will get bigger and this one is looking stunning i really like this way and the best part of it because you can see when the planets are coming in front of the suns like this one is looking very tiny and oh my god this one is very fast this one is really fast the small one and this is one this one so it's looking absolutely incredible the distance so everything is absolutely phenomenal so let's come back in our code editor and let's have a look on the code so here have we have we are into the html part so i, can, I hope you guys can see that so like a normal things that he has done so these are the navigations the controls options and this is how he have designed the universe so galaxy all the things venus earth 
planets, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and so on. And these are the some media queries. These, and these are the jQueries he has used in this project. And let's come to the CSS. So you can easily able to check all the CSS, all the all the codes he has written. So it's already there in the code pan. So you guys can check. And this is the JavaScript. This is the JavaScript which he has written for this project. So just go through that. Like uh, this is the person. This is his repo. So let's come here. You can guys can mark this, mark this one. So it's Julian G A R and Gainier. So this is the one who has created, and it's absolutely amazing. And I'm really a fan of this person because I really love to do creative coding, and this is one of such a creative kind. So I'm really impressed with that. Hand stop to this creator. Okay. So hope you guys have liked this project. So I want you all of you to come and explore the source code because you will learn a lot of things. Because coding is all about your creativity solving a particular problems so just have a look and check out the functionality he has introduced how he has tackled the particular problem and then you compare your code with him because as you know at the end of the time you have to solve a particular problem when you are working any kind of project so you have to think logically so you have to build your thinking capability and that's why i always come to this repo and check the source code although i can build that but how you optimize you can build that's one is more important so it's always great to come so whenever you start working any project come look at the source code there might be already a couple of projects are already there in code pan and if you do a google, quick google search you will find the similar project just have a have a look on the source code that how they're building the building the entire structure of the project and then you can then then it's become very easy to build that okay so just go through this structure just have a look at the source code everything is provided by him and i'm really glad that he has shared this entire amazing project on this code pan so we can easily able to learn a lot of things from him so just check guys it's absolutely incredible so hope you have liked this video if you have any questions any doubt do leave in the comment section i would love to help you in that and from today onward i'm going to make uh, this kind of video every day where we're going to find amazing product on CodePan and on other coding platforms and I will come up and I will show you that how they are writing it okay so you guys can take the reference and build your own and I'm also learning from them as well so for the time being that's it if you're new to my channel hit that like and subscribe button that will motivate me to come up with this amazing video and I hope you're enjoying it too learning too so that's it keep learning and be happy have a great day. Bye-bye.